Hello everyone, this is Chef Saito. Ding. So today we will have another episode Chef Saito's Washok Tips. Okay, so today we have I'm, this is Japanese pickles. So it's with vegetables. So simple cooking and tasty, looking nice and happy. So this is and easy to so you can try at your home it's easier okay so this is i'm gonna show you ingredients today so cauliflower cabbage sweet heart of cabbage and paprikas different colors and daikon radish sorry i cut it already and uh, it is in mini cucumber this is tasty and fresh then carrot and kombu. This is Japanese kombu. This is from Hokkaido. It's nice flavor. Of course, you can find another things, no problem. So just kombu. So the ingredients. So rice vinegar, sugar, jam, Japanese salt. Of course, you can get local salt anywhere, no problem. But if you can find Japanese salt, it's gonna be more tasty. Okay, so now I'm going to show you how to prepare for Japanese pickles. Otsukemono. Okay, so now what we're we gonna do? Okay, make the pickles vinegar. So rice vinegar, salt. And sugar. Jam. So just mix. So basically, this pickles vinegar is same as like a sushi vinegar, which is uh, when you make the sushi. So for the sushi rice, so this vinegar, the balance, the same. So basically, for the pickles vinegar sugar and salt so these three things is good for the keeping the product for the long okay so okay so it's very quick to get jam. okay jam so this is a uh, pickles vinegar it's ready okay so this one just we got a container. Okay, put inside and a uh, little water. Okay, so then kombu. Okay, just to put inside the kombu. So then it's ready to pickles on the vegetables okay so now we're gonna cut the vegetable okay so now the vegetables Okay, so now we get a vegetable and uh, pickles vinegar. So let's put together now, okay? So basically we are going to marinate 24 hours today. But of course you like try 48 hours as well. So then even one week, it's no problem. So it is like good experiment. So depends. So you can try and uh, what you like yeah so you can make own the pickle style no problem so now we're gonna put together so first one like strong like root vegetables carrot so then this one please don't use your hand straight away so you need to the globe or some chopsticks okay so don't put your hand this is really important So then try to separate it, like this is a carrot side, and radish, and uh, cabbage, 
Okay, so then after when you pick up, easy to. So like this, then jam kitchen towel paper. So you can put it because this is you can cover all vegetables. So if you want to keep longer, you can reduce the liquid, the slowly, slowly. And if you want it tomorrow, so 24 hours later, so just nice, like a bus style, okay? Nice marinade, so you can enjoy tomorrow. Also for the other ones. Okay, so now it's ready. So this vegetable is going to sleep 24 hours, okay? So, see you later, 24 hours, everyone. Let's see what's going on. Ciao! Bye! Jam! Then, so, 24 hours after. Now, we can check how it's going. Our pickles, so Japanese tsukemono. Okay, I pick up. So, yesterday, 24 hours before, we done. So, how is now? Let's check. Mm, smell is very nice. So, let's see. Oh, color is beautiful. Mm. Cucumber, cauliflower, cabbage. Ooh, looks nice. Nice color. And radish as well. Okay. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you traditional way. Okay, presentation. Okay, typical style. Okay, let's do it. So basically this is a nice color. The plate is a summer style, it's a nice brew, and uh, this is really freshness. So nice color balance, put it here together. So this is the traditional way to presentation. So let's make, I have another nice plate. So I'm gonna show you a little bit modern style of picture presentation. Okay, next level. So at the moment this is 24 hours. So taste is, of course, is really good. But if you like more, so 48 hours is also you can do it. So after 48 hours, it's a, if you like keep more, so just take out of all the pickles vinegars. Take out. Just keep with a kitchen towel. Put it in a container so you can keep at least one week. So no problem. Okay. Eat this cup. So basically I use the rice vinegar. But of course you can use like uh, apple vinegar and uh, other vinegars. Yes, white vinegar. So you can use it. So just like pointed salt and sugar and uh, just check the taste nice balance not too salty not too sweet okay so this is very very important so this is a nice modern style of pickles so this is like okay as a side dishes pickles 
with rice or things. But this is just as a starter, so you can make it looks nice. So you can play the vegetables, different cutting. So you can put like looks nice, modern, fancy. So just same things, but you can play different things. So this is kind of technique. Okay, so this is really interesting on your table. Yes! So now it look beautiful tsukemono. Yes, Japanese pickles. It's vegetables. So let's try it. So it was really good. Nice, beautiful. So I tried radish, daikon radish. Mmm. Nice texture, mm. nice sourness, mm. flavor of radish. Mm. It's really, really nice. Oishi! Okay, so <laughs> it was really nice. So, nice presentation, nice taste. It's good for your body too. So, um, ingredients is very simple. So, vinegar 500 milliliter and water 500 milliliter and sugar 250 gram and salt 75 gram like this ingredients so it's very simple just pickles pickles and 24 hours so you can be ready also 48 hours no problem okay so you can see this plate is really beautiful plate. My favorite plate I got in the UK. Shop name is Made in Japan. So I was just Made in Japan, the product. So they have nice shop in the UK. So you can find out the below links, okay? So they have really nice, beautiful plates. You can have it. So everybody, so this time, nice pickles so you can have nice variety of your menu on your house Done! <laughs> thank you very much for watching today it was really nice episode so chef Saito washuk tips success okay so hope you can enjoy see you next time bye thank you Bye!